Hi, John Clements for the UMass Fruit Advisor. Today is October 6, 2011. I'm here at the UMass Cold Spring Orchard in a mixed block of Macintosh and Honeycrisp, which have already been picked. But I have some Liberty apple trees in here for a pollinator, and I wanted to show you these Liberties quickly. Um, we did have some hail damage in here, so don't pay attention to that. Those fruit are no good. But here you can see um, Liberty's a very uh, nice dark red, attractive apple. Um, gets 95% full red color. Um, always produces a good crop. Um, it has a, a crab apple in its background, which gives it the uh, scab resistance, but also makes it a productive tree. Now here, um, well into the first week in October, I think it's a little late to pick these Liberty. You can see there's some fruit on the ground. I would have normally picked it about October 1st here in Massachusetts. Um, the fruit's somewhat conical, flat to conical. Um, again, the trees are quite productive. The fruit has a um, mostly a sweet tart flavor. Um, I think right now they're a little over the hill. Again, I like to get them a little bit on the green side um, and then put them in storage. Uh, Retain does wonders for helping keep the fruit from going uh, uh, too ripe like these particular ones are here, but um, these don't hap happen to have Retain. When they're getting very ripe, you can see they get this very dark, dark red color. Um, a good apple for making uh, fresh cider, good for baking, and some people like them for fresh eating. Again, it's scab resistant. There's some more hail damage. Um, hasn't really caught on in the commercial trade, but um, a very productive, easy to grow tree. Uh, these are Bud 9 rootstock here. You can see uh, these were planted in 2006. So um, a very uh, uh, easy to manage tree when planted on dwarf rootstocks and very productive every year. These Liberties will, will really produce every year um, very nicely. So that's Liberty, a scab resistant apple variety picked about October 1st here in Massachusetts. Um, I need to get these picked ASAP and I'll let you know a little bit about some of the uh, fruit quality characteristics here um, at the very end. Otherwise, we'll see you uh, next time I pick some apples.